Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian K. Stay frosty. What's going on everyone and welcome back to another high quality foodie feature for you here on the channel. With this time I'm over at Taco Bell to check out one of their quote unquote new cravings value menu items now available for a limited time only. And I'm only saying quote unquote new because I have a feeling you've seen something like this before over here. So without further ado, let's get into it. Guys, feast your eyes on the beefy melt burrito. Not a bad situation here, but it looks like we've got plenty of rice to go around for sure. All right, so very simply what this consists of is their standard flour tortilla, nice and warm, filled with seasoned beef, nacho cheese sauce, seasoned rice, reduced fat sour cream, a three cheese blend, and it looks like some red strips thrown in for good measure, guys. But again, very familiar, all those classic ingredients from Taco Bell, wrapped up good to go, and for two bucks, not a bad value, I'm thinking. But on the real, I'm a little concerned by how much beef is actually in what I'm looking at here right now because it looks like it's more of a rice show than anything else. But still, definitely digging the color variation with the red strips. Let me just see if I can confirm the goodness and hopefully there's some seasoned beef in here considering what this is supposed to have, right? Here we go, guys. It's the all new Beefy Melt Burrito for two bucks over here at Taco Bell. Let's do it. Hmm. Okay, it's in there. I guess it was more front loaded with the rice right there because I got actually a nice bite of beef with that. But as you guys can see, all the comfort food goodies from Taco Bell made just a little bit better because it's actually during the rain that I'm filming this right now. I'm really digging the fact that this is storming outside of my car, nice and warm. And as you guys can see, plenty of rice and all the other goodies mixed together. Classic Taco Bell for a $2 value. And the size is not bad on this one. Oh, and did I mention this is pretty much familiar? I had a feeling what this was gonna be like before I even got into it, because guys, if you've had one beef burrito over here at Taco Bell, you've pretty much had them all. With the addition of the reduced fat sour cream and all the nacho cheese sauce goodies in this, of course, it's those classic timeless flavors. Let's just keep going in, guys. Not bad, though. Not bad at all. Hmm. There we go. We've got every ingredient on display for you there. Plenty of that seasoned beef goodness mixed throughout along with the nacho cheese sauce, the seasoned rice, the three cheese blend, and the reduced fat sour cream, all wrapped up in a nice warm flour tortilla. Like I said, classic timeless flavors. And again, not bad for two bucks. But you know, as good as this tastes right now, I think the other two that they have on the menu are gonna be a little bit more interesting. So watch for those to come soon. But as it stands, guys, very tasty on this one because it's those familiar flavors, like I said, that you're used to. And like I said, it's accentuated even more because of how much rain is hitting my car here right now. This is just fun to eat because it's nice and warm and it's familiar. That seems to be the theme of Taco Bell lately. So let's go for one more bite in on this one because honestly, guys, there's really not too much else to say about this one. It's all those classic flavors from Taco Bell. But I do have to say the addition of the red strips to this for some color variation is not bad, although they're getting just a little soggy, but you're still getting the extra carbiness on top of everything else. Still the familiar flavors, like I said, ad nauseum throughout this review. And for two bucks, not a bad deal. Let's go for one more bite and we'll close this one out. Hang on. Yeah, there's something about that reduced fat sour cream along with the nacho cheese sauce that dovetails so nicely in with the seasoned beef and then all the other goodies in here, guys. Again, very cool for two bucks. The size is not bad on it. And overall, you're gonna get exactly what you're expecting with this one, classic Taco Bell flavor on the value menu item, AKA the cravings goodness. Not bad, guys, not bad at all. Order ahead and pick yours up at our contactless drive-thru. So with that said, I'm gonna have to give the quote unquote new beefy melt burrito here at Taco Bell off of their cravings value menu, a pretty decent seven out of 10. And I'm not gonna go much higher than that because guys, like I said, total familiarity that you'd expect from Taco Bell. They seem to be closing out the year with all the usual goodies. Nothing really crazy with that one, but still the value is decent for two bucks. I definitely like the size. It feels very good in the hand. Obviously it's nice and warm and it sure has enough ingredients on the inside along with the size to justify a pretty decent price point of two bucks. Definitely give this one a shot if you haven't already. And speaking of giving it a shot, do me a quick favor as always, drop some comments down below. Let me know what you thought of this one when you got it and was it worth the $2 to you? Drop those comments down below and definitely let me know. And with that, this is Ian K closing out another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Out Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So I stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. You know, I would say this is pretty much $2 well spent because if you're a fan of Taco Bell, you know what to expect. So we're getting all of their famous ingredients wrapped up good to go. It's always a good thing. All right, everyone, until next time, I'll talk to you soon. Hey, thanks for checking out another one of my reviews. But just in case you didn't see the one before this one, you can find it right up over here along with what I think YouTube's gonna recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something like in both of them and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya.